Hi, this is a sample application which is talking about COVID-19 impact on the world. We have used multiple data sets over here to show as many insights as possible. This is an overview of the application. Here on the first sheet, you can see the data has been pulled in from public data sources to represent the confirmed cases, the active cases, the deaths, the recovered across different countries, uh, across different time of uh, different uh, months of the year. Now, if you want to deep dive into it, you can actually click on it and see specific to that particular country, which is the US over here. Or else, if I want to change the view and see the COVID impact on other aspects of the world, I will bring in other data sets. I will switch my screen to show you some other data sets. Here is the data set related to National Air Quality Index. I have taken the data for India region. Here, this is a report for, uh, which is talking about the impact of COVID-19 on the civil aviation. This is a PDF file from which we are extracting the relevant data. So now let's see what my application talks about. Coming back to the application, if I scroll this, it talks about relief fund analysis by countries. It talks about the impact of COVID on different stock markets. Uh, these are just the different kinds of data sets that I've brought in in the application to give as many meaningful insights as possible. So I've brought in the NASDAQ, the Nifty, the Sensex data, the airline industry data and the impact caused due to COVID-19. This, as you can see, the source mentioned over here was the PDF file that I was just talking about. Now let's talk about the air quality index. So COVID impact on the pollution and the air quality index across India region. I've given the data source mentioned over here. So this way I have made my application more rich in terms of insights. I can add much more and you're free to do so. Think on the lines, what is publicly available and can make a lot of difference to your analysis. For example, demographics data. This can be brought in from any census survey of any country, be it the US, be it India. This data is publicly available. Uh, you can bring in geospatial data, which is talking about the latitude and longitude. So let's take this example where the government had issued the list of red zone districts, orange zone districts, and the green zone districts. Uh, if you bring in the latitude and longitude, you can actually plot this on a map and show the geographical representation. You can think on uh, more lines and you're free to explore different data sets. Good luck with the hack.